hello guys in this video i am going to introduce you to this new tool called as farfalle farfalle is an open sourced ai powered search engine farfalle is primarily is an italian word which means butterfly and it is a bow tie shaped italian pasta that can also be described as butterfly shaped pasta so the name farfalle primarily means butterflies in italian and it is a quite famous dish from italy but we are not going to uh, learn about farfalle dish rather we'll be installing this farfalle on our local system on windows and then we will see how it goes the tech stack for farfalle is com comprised of front end is nextjs back end is fast api for search api we will be using tavily and you would need an api key from tavily so just go to tavily dot com or it's just such tavily api you should be able to get it for logging it is using logfire for rate limiting it is using redis and there are few other components which are mentioned in the github repo and i'll drop the link to it in video's description i will be using um, powershell to get it installed there are few prerequisites which you need to have for instance make sure that you have node installed i already have it npm should be there python should be there and make sure that you have poetry installed if you don't know how to install these things uh, they are very simple just search in the google that install node.js on your system and once you install node.js it is going to install node and npm for python again you can just search it and it is simple installer which you click next 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 and it should install for poetry all you need to do is to do this pip install poetry and you should be good to go another thing i will be using open ai for this so make sure that you go to platform.openai.com grab your open ai from there and then simply do open ai underscore api underscore key here or you would need to create an environment file with in the root directory of the project and then you should be good to go and i will show you how to create that file so before that we would need to clone this repo so in order to grab the link to this repo all you need to do is to go back to this website which is a git uh, git repo for this project just click on this green button and grab that url let's go back to powershell and here just write uh, wherever you want to install so maybe i will okay i'll just put it here so i'm just going to do git clone and then i am going to put the url of it so let me delete the other one that is good let's press enter and you can just type yes okay so it says permission denied so it seems that i would need to log into github or so let me quickly log in there or alternatively if you don't want to log in you can simply download this zip file on your local system and then unzip it that's all you need to do so let me uh, undownload the zip file and unzip it I have unzipped that directory which I had loaded, uh, downloaded from the GitHub, and then I am right now in that directory as you can see after unzipping it. From here, you can just simply go to cd source and then cd front end. Now, here all you need to do is to install the front end, and for that, the command is very simple pnpm install and it is going to install the front end on your local system and it is installing the front end for us let's wait for it to finish and you can also use npm if you don't have pnpm just type npm install and should be good front end is done let's clear the screen now let's go back uh, let's go to backend and now simply do poetry install let's press enter here and it is going to create the virtual environment and all the backend let's wait for it to finish
backend is also done as you can see now in the next step let's go to the root folder where we have this farfalle installed the uh, github repo which we have cloned or downloaded and unzipped simply create a new file here which is a text document call it .env delete the extension that is fine click yes and then open it with the notepad just select notepad and here just put in paste in this these three keys now i will be only using tabli's api key and openai's api key so for that go to tabli.com this is the tabli's website and from here just sign up sign in and grab your api key from your profile for free and then for openai's api key you would need to go to platform.openai.com if it is your first account i think you will get some credit you can use that or if you want to use llama 2 um, 70 billion you would need to go to grok's website grok and grab the api key from there i already have my api key so i'm going to put them here just i will do the first two and then i will save it and exit from the file so all the configuration is done now we need to start the application first we need to start the front end so let me clear the screen first i will go one step back and then front end from here we just need to run pnpm dev or npm dev if you are using that one so let me press enter here so you see it has started and it is ready which is good so let it run maybe open another window go to backend so i have opened another window for powershell and then i'm just going to go into cd source cd backend and from here simply type poetry shell and it is going to um, initialize the backend for you and then we will re reload it so you see that it has spawned this shell within it that is good and now let's reload it and for reloading it all we need to do is to just type ubicon backend dot main dot app and reload in the backend and you see that it has started that process here and now you can simply access it on the local host on that port so there you go so this is your powerful running locally and you can ask it whatever question you want to ask you can change the uh, background from here hopefully nope okay so now let me ask it one of the question you can simply ask let's ask it what is farfle just click on it or type it here i'm clicking on it nothing is working anyway just going to ask it here then what is farfle press enter why it's not enter working let me reload it again okay took a bit of a time but at least it is working now that is good speed is quite fast that is nice and then you can ask a follow-up um okay that is nice and then you can ask it uh which city in yeah, italy is popular for for fully and then let's wait there you go so it is talking about lombardy and some other region romana region amazing stuff let's scroll up and then um, you can ask the follow-up now i just want to know how i can clear the screen because there are very few options okay so you would have to cl uh, click here in the top left so let me show you how can i show you from the top left okay okay sorry for that i just adjusted my screen just to make sure that i could show you so once you ask it something like what is um maybe i'll ask it who is fahad mirza press enter and then let's see okay so it has gone in search for some information okay 
I am talking about more famous one, the heart mirror, the AIU pupil. Let's see if it is able to find me. Yep, it, it was able to find me. That is awesome. So we are famous now. And then it is also that is good related one. So that is um who is Fahad Mirza Chukdai and then specialize on what content he specializes in then it is going to follow up the questions amazing stuff amazing amazing so the, it even found my photo and along with some other people so what i was saying is if you want to clear the screen just click on top left here and it is going to uh, clear it and what is this fast thing the so fast is it is using open as gpt 3.5 powerful is gpt 4.0 if you want to use grok lama because i also put in my grok api key so it is also giving me that option how good is that anyway i could play with it all day and so a powered search engine locally running on your windows um if you i think the only thing which is lacking now is to run it with olama or any local llms but other than that awesome tool really impressed by it let me know what do you think i will drop the link to it in video description if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel if you're already subscribed, then please share it among your network as it helps a lot. Thanks for watching.